All right, so I've got the Hoover Caddy bag taken apart here. So, <laughs> I'm never using this silicone adhesive for this again. Um, mostly just because it hardened up a lot more than I thought it was going to. And this is going to be a pain in the ass to scrape off, so. Learn something new every day. The only reason I did it is because the way this sits in the motor housing, a lot of dust gets around here, even though it's not supposed to, and then it flies out through the back of the machine and gets dust all over in here. But here's the motor. And I did this with the Hoover Legacy when I had that apart as well. Oh well. That's not even my dirt. <laughs> this is from whenever I last had it apart. I mean, I guess last time I had it apart, I just didn't do a very good job of cleaning it out a little. <laughs> At least that's what I'm gathering. That's because of that I know that's not my dirt. I don't have anything that has hair that looks like this. It's a lot of rust on the motor. But the um, armature looks good. Commutator looks passable. Ooh, I can actually drop some oil in the other bearing there. Cool. If I can just reach my oil thing back in there. But this bearing I'm going to grease because I can actually get it apart. I think the only reason re way you can really get to the end bearing is by taking this fan off, which I don't know how. And take... Yeah, I don't know how. I'm going to have to learn how to eventually because... This fan is pretty, pretty, very beat up. Um, it's pretty chewed. So, but yeah, I'm gonna have to get out my Omega here and use it on reverse mode. Blow this thing out really well. Compressed air is better, but this gets the job done. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I feel like the last time I had this apart, I must just not have done a very good job of. You know, doing a good job. <laughs> I mean, I know I had to get out a lot of hair that was in here. You can see how much dust is in here from how much I've been using it lately. Because these things don't really do a good job of keeping dust out of the motor. But these motors are so well built, you clean them up and they're fine. But yeah, I'm definitely going to be greasing this bearing. But the main reason I'm doing this video, uh, I don't think it's as bad as the legacy was. But I figured you guys would still get a good laugh. loose and that's yeah, got play in it so we'll be greasing that and I'm going to try and angle my oil under there obviously I can't take that bearing apart right now but I can at least get some oil in that area obviously a lot of it's not even going to make it into the bearing it's just going to make a mess but it's still worth giving it a try at, um, getting some oil into that bearing because that'll be better than nothing it's probably just as dry as this one is up here but this one since i can get to it it's getting greased so yeah 